hello everyone i hope you're all having a wonderful sunday i was going to be bringing you all another video on some of our current projects but there's something we need to address and i've been getting a lot of phone calls regarding this so we need to talk about that too so yes you read the title right youtube has had some major scam problems i'm getting fed up with it i've done all the damage control i could possibly do i'm sure if you guys watch and comment on the videos you know exactly what i'm talking about there are people there, I say people, they're scammers, right? That take and save my profile picture. I'm not the only one. They do it to every single YouTube profile out there. They'll take and save the profile photo that I use or Cletus or, you know, Gentry and Sons, literally everybody. And they will change the username. So most of the time you guys don't really look at the username. You'll just see the profile picture and say, yep, that's Bruce, that's Garrett, that's, you know, Tim, stuff like that. And you'll think that's one of us actually talking to you. And I do comment and talk in my comments down below and like and things like that. But anyways, these people will save the photo and they'll say, contact me on Telegram or congratulations, you've won. You know, I'll throw some uh, examples up here while we're talking. And they'll say, contact me through Telegram or through some other social media outlet or some other way to contact you. And what they do is they'll find someone that, I'm not going to say dumb enough because that's a terrible word to say, gullible maybe, um, you know, and what, the, what they, it's, it's sad, but I really need some of you guys to use your better judgment because this happens all the time where they will prey on someone that is a, you know, very faithful follower of a social media influencer and tell them that they've won a prize. And I've had so many phone calls in the last week. I just cannot keep getting phone calls regarding this. I can deal with emails and I try to reply to as many as possible, but the phone calls are getting to be too much on my personal cell phone um, that we use for business also. And the, what they're doing is they're telling this person they've won a pressure washer, they've won this, they've won that. And in order to win this pressure washer, they've got to send these people 140 or 200, $140, $200 through PayPal, through friends and family, which you should never ever do unless you know the other person on the other side of PayPal you're sending the money to and you you know them, like you personally know them. And they're scamming these people. So they're getting their money and they're not sending them anything because they're scam artists. And they're taking and preying on people that, you know, are falling for this. So this is becoming a major problem because a lot of my viewers are thinking it's me that is scamming them. They're thinking that I'm the one doing this giveaway. Guys, we've done a few giveaways with the grease guns, things like that. If you do some, you know, if you do end up winning something from us, you will be getting a phone call directly from myself personally and an email directly from brucewilsonshop at gmail.com. That will be the only two methods I ever, ever contact you guys. It'll be my cell phone or brucewilsonshop at gmail.com. I do not use Telegram. I do not use any other way of contacting you about winning something from us. It will be my phone number, and you hear my voice on the other line, or it will be brucewilsonshop at gmail.com. I'll put it right down here, brucewilsonshop at gmail.com. That would be the only way I will ever, ever contact any of you. Now, I do have, you know, Instagram, and my only Instagram handle is Bruce underscore D underscore Wilson. Okay? Put that right here, too. Bruce underscore D underscore Wilson. If you message me on there, I'll reply back, or if I send you a message for whatever reason, that's the only way I will ever get in contact with you through Instagram. And I do have two Facebook pages, actually three. I have my personal, which is Bruce Wilson. I've got another Facebook page we post some stuff on. There's a third with a company that we work with that posts my YouTube videos to Facebook. So there are three total Bruce Wilson Facebook pages. Um, they all have different profile pictures. So, you know, use your better judgment, but do not ever, 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 ever send money to anyone ever through PayPal, friends and family, unless you have met that person before or they are a true friend that you know privately or a true family member that you know. Guys, so all these scammers are out there to take money from everybody, your hard earned cash. Once you send it, it is gone forever. You will never see it back. You're never gonna get anything in the mail, any of that. It's just gone forever. It is a true scam. Sorry about this, my hand's getting, getting tired of holding the phone up, but that is what's going on with the scam stuff. Next thing I want to address is 
you guys calling my personal cell phone number. Yes, I use my cell phone for our business phone also, but that doesn't mean you contact me and say, hey Bruce, I commented on this. Um, they said this, said that on your phone, on your YouTube video. Guys, These there are thousands of these scam comments and hundreds of you are calling me. And, and I understand it up till making this video now, but if you guys call me to say that you've got a scam comment, I'm not gonna be the happiest person when I answer the phone because I get so many of these phone calls and it's hard to decipher a random number calling me from being a customer that's actually ready to buy a tractor from us or do business with us or you know someone that actually needs to contact me for any other reason other than to report a scam on the YouTube channel, which you know I shouldn't be having to deal with these phone calls because these scammers are making my life hard and everyone else's life hard. But don't use my phone number ever. And I mean ever, unless you're contacting me to buy a tractor. Other than that, my phone number is off limits to everybody unless you're contacting me to buy something. Because that phone number is a mode of you know, conducting business. That is all that phone number is for. Or for me to talk to my family members or my family members to call me. It's not for fans to call me and you know say, I understand you guys love my videos, but the phone number is for business purposes only or private use. It's not for you guys to get in contact with me. If you want to get in contact with me and say how much you like the videos or you know, want to talk through that, I do talk to everybody through email all the time or my Instagram, Bruce underscore D underscore Wilson. Again, put it right here. Or through email, brucewilsonshop at gmail.com. Right here too. You guys can feel free to contact me through either of those at any time. Drop me an email, stuff like that. That is the best way to get a hold of me if you want to have a conversation. And boy, how disappointed I am in YouTube. It's like you can make a YouTube account and go straight to commenting immediately. You know, it's like on these you know forums back in the day, some of you guys may or may not remember forums, but if you were became a forum member and you wanted a discussion forum, you had to um, make actual posts and be a member of the community, or you had to have been on there for so long before you could actually start making posts. And right now you can make a YouTube account and just go straight to commenting. And what these scammers are doing, they're making thousands upon thousands of, of YouTube accounts and just changing the names on them. And I, whatever these scammers make a comment, right? They'll make like 40 or 50 at once on all the comments. And what I can go in there and do is hide the user from the channel permanently to where they can never interact on my YouTube channel ever. They can watch it, I think, maybe, maybe not. But they're, that one user is gone, but that's only one upon thousands of other scammers that are on here operating using my profile picture. So every video, I'm literally getting on here hiding users from the channel for hours on end, and it is so much work. And it'd be nice if you guys just understood that these people that are commenting are not real. I know Cletus has addressed this in some of his videos. He hasn't made a dedicated video, but it's like, I don't feel I need to make a dedicated video, but it's got to the point where you guys are, I keep saying you guys, it's not everybody, so please don't think that, but where so many people are contacting me, telling me this, I know all about it. Don't ever send money to anybody. Don't ever send money to any, anyone, like ever. You know, you, you'll never win anything unless you're contacted directly from that influencer. Like even Garrett, people that have won the cars and stuff, they do giveaways and Greg A, they will call you directly. You will hear their voice on the other end of the line and you'll get an email directly from their business emails. Not any of this Telegram crap or any of this stuff. And it's really upsetting to me that YouTube doesn't have some better policy or better program to take care of these people that are dropping all of these comments. There should be something where it limits like how many comments can be made on one video or you have to have a YouTube channel for so long before you can make comments or even maybe you have to make post at least one or two videos before you're able to comment on videos. But the the scams are just it's just getting bad and I feel bad for the people that I had a, a viewer I'm not going to mention their names and you know if you, I'm sure you're going to be watching this and I'm, I'm not trying to make you feel bad but that actually sent someone $140 for this pressure washer guys if it sounds too good to be true it's always too good to be true every single time if you think you're going to get this said product that you've won for that costs five thousand dollars and you only have to send them fifty or a hundred dollars to get it it's a scam it's always a scam don't send the money so with all this being said you all are full warned if you call me on my cell phone to talk about these scams you're not going to get a happy bruce on the other side of the phone i'm going to tell you that right now 
And if you send money to these scammers, I don't feel bad for you anymore. I've addressed this. This is probably the second time I've addressed this. So don't send money to anyone ever, ever through PayPal, unless they are someone you've met and shook their hand in person or gave them a hug, whatever it may be. But never send money to someone you don't know using friends and family because you don't have the protection you need through PayPal. So don't ever do it. If it sounds too good to be true, it's too good to be true. Don't freaking do it. And screw all the freaking scammers out there that are taking advantage of my viewers. It's absolutely sad. And you watch. I almost guarantee it. You will see the comments down below of these scammers commenting on this video trying to get you guys to send them money where it's saying you've won something. So you watch. I guarantee it's going to happen. And it's just sad. So we'll be back to our regular scheduled programming. <laughs> Tomorrow, working on the white cap over, and uh, hopefully YouTube uh, sees this video and does something about it. I know they know what's going on, but they just haven't done anything about it, and it's sad because they're letting all their viewers, you know, be taken advantage of, and it's just, it's sad. So, catch you guys later. Peace.